All right, I'm showing off my e-bike that I created, uh, the springtime 2017. I have uh, two controllers, one here, one there. I have a battery there, a battery here. Both of them are 52 volt, uh, 20 amp hours. So, have lights back here. It's kind of a show bike. Have, of course, road tires. Uh, these are thousand watt motors. I still have room to have one water bottle and a, a, a thousand watt motor uh, on the front. A uh, place to put my cell phone, my controller. I, ha I have electronic horn and I can play my music. Uh, of course, my controller there, my speedometer, uh, nothing fancy. Love my bike. Now I got a horn there as well. I use these, these black burns there. Uh, I, I used to use those as far as my lights and my flashers until the speed increased. Then I had to put these super brights on and it, and it really brightens up the road so I can see exactly where I'm going. I have uh, some pretty nice uh, pedals with the little knobs to them uh, as, as far as that's the battery for the Blackburn the, the the front two headlights this is the battery for the super brights this is my music that I play plus it, it is a horn itself um, it's, it's, it's made by Trek which uh, oh my rider back in the back they have a chance to use their their horn power as well or bell power so basically I have this set up so we we can ride and enjoy ourselves and, and and have a good time we have a lot of different places to ride as far as um, uh, around Detroit metro area um, trails and streets and pretty much everything I figure with the uh, 52 volt batteries um, this this bike actually has uh, 3,000 watts of power it has it has high torque uh, of course since I have a is a tandem I, I, I put a, a second um, hub on it first I had the front hub and it was great it worked great and as we were Riding around, we have this cruise, it's called the Dream Cruise, that goes down the main street, uh, Woodward, where I end up, uh, uh, we, we, we were riding, and, and since I've had this bike, since uh, about 17 years, about 17 years, and slowly putting upgrades on the bike, I, I ended up uh, uh, fracturing the rear hub, well, the rear, the, the rear rim, where I put, um, um, yeah, we, we we had to walk maybe, maybe about a, a quarter of a mile um, be, before I got to the car because we, we didn't drive down to the Dream Cruise. We wanted to have fun. Uh, we didn't want to go all the way, well, it would have been maybe about a 20 mile drive before we actually got on a dream cruise and it, it was kind of late when we got there this switch right here on this controller I, I, I put on there so either I can run the front hub solely or I can run the back hub solely or I can incorporate both hubs together um, it, it's a little bit too much power um, this bike on, on flat surfaces uh, if, if, if we're both bent, bent forward, uh, not allowing the air uh, to hit us, it, it, it hits 40 miles an hour very easily. If, if we're sitting upwards um, and, and the wind is hitting us, depending uh, in which direction the wind, it's uh, 30, 38, 36 miles an hour. So we still lose a little, but not a whole lot. Um, I had to change the brakes, of course. These are cool stops. They're really good. They don't 
make noise or anything and they and and they re work very well I wish I could put disc brakes on uh, uh, I forgot what you call it. that's that's a torque right there I have a torque in, in the front and the back um, a torque arm uh, what 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 happens is, is that I had the regular brakes of course those brakes weren't working very well and of course I had to put fenders on because when you hit just a little speck of water it, it, it flies up and I got tired of it hitting my face and everything else so anyway to make a long story short I just wanted just to show you the bike this year I plan on doing some improvements next year uh, with this bike and I'm gonna make a, a, a single bike because uh, then I can ride more in, in, in adverse weather conditions because of my my uh, uh, riders they choose not to ride um, in any kind of weather they like uh, nice warm hot days so or warm hot nights so with that to say uh, th this is how I turn on the back the back uh, battery and this is how I turn on the front battery and uh, pretty much I, I believe that's it but I'm gonna make a, 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 a e-bike just for me I'm gonna have pedal assist on it this right here I'm thinking about getting one large controller incorporating uh, both batteries together so I can have pedal assist on this because uh, kind of works out better because I'm 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 using the throttle. I'm I'm not uh, at times giving a bunch of gas, and uh, you know it's still hard to gauge how you can pedal with the uh, um, you know using your throttle versus if you have pedal assist, and then you can actually adjust your your uh, amount of uh, assist and. Um, Pretty much that's it. Okay, well, thanks a lot. Just want you to see the, the, the bike itself. And uh, I will be talking to you in the future. Uh, I guess uh, 2018. Victor, peace.